Namaskar. How are we doing guys? I'm very excited today because WhatsApp for Business is finally launched in India. And this is an exciting phase for us as marketers because now the lead generation process is going to be much more streamlined. In fact, a lot more cost effective solutions will be now planned for businesses, especially for small businesses who cannot really invest in landing pages, who can't really invest in good websites. They can actually make use of WhatsApp for Business and drive immediate conversions for them. So what is WhatsApp for Business? It's a new version of WhatsApp. There's not much difference that I will show you right now. And uh, this is a separate app. So when you download WhatsApp, you have to download WhatsApp for Business in case you want to use this particular feature. It allows you to directly drive inquiries from Facebook ads to WhatsApp. So you will, if you remember in December 2017, there was a message which was rolled out that People can send you messages directly by clicking on your Facebook advertisement. So when they click on message as feature, they can directly message you right there on WhatsApp. So you can see that feature right here. It's a send message button, but it comes along with the WhatsApp logo. So this WhatsApp logo is just an indication that people can directly WhatsApp you instead of sending you message on Messenger. Currently, this particular call to action button is not available for everyone. So I'm waiting for that feature as well. I'm sure most of us are waiting for this in India. Now this is going to allow you to create auto reply. WhatsApp for business allows you to create auto reply, especially when you have a lot of messages flowing in, this makes it a lot more easier and it can become part of your marketing automation chain. And I will show you how. So to activate WhatsApp for business, first you have to download the app and you need to have a separate number for this. In case you're using your same number, then you'll have to say goodbye to your personal WhatsApp account. So you have to take a wise decision here. But the best part of converting your personal account into WhatsApp for businesses, you already have contacts up there who would want to chat with you. So you don't have to really save their number or you don't have to do any kind of change or difference. So there will be an audience who will be ready to hear you. So what I have done, I have converted my personal WhatsApp account into a business account because it's so easy for me to now communicate and test this feature at least. So WhatsApp for business is something that you would want to download. And if you're an Android user, you can do it right away. Once you download, you need to register your company name for once and this cannot be changed. That's what WhatsApp claims. So I saved Saurav Jain and that's my name on WhatsApp. So you will have to decide your company's name and you have to save that up because you can't change this again. I'm sure maybe two years, three years down the line, this feature would differ. Currently, there's no customized URL for your business account, unlike Twitter or Facebook. So maybe that would be one of the features that WhatsApp will be soon launching as well. Now features of WhatsApp for Business. When you launch WhatsApp for Business for a minute, you'll be, what is the difference here? It's just the same thing. You have the same chats, you have the same status, you have the same call options, you have the same contacts up there who you can message. So there's not much difference. But the only difference that you would see in the settings section is in business settings. Now this is where you will probably see a lot of different features which we never saw in the normal WhatsApp. So let's look at what are those features. Business setting gives you five important things. It gives you profile settings, it gives you statistics, it gives you away message, greeting message and quick replies. Now I will be putting across those important things which actually make sense for us. It is also the differentiating factor between WhatsApp for personal reasons and WhatsApp for business. Let's look at profile settings. In profile settings, you can add your business address, you can add the location, you can define your business category, you can add your business description, and you can have your email address as well as your website URL. So this is how your profile will look after you fix things. You can even mark your location on the map, which is the good part. I'm not too sure at this point of time how WhatsApp for business, especially the locations are going to be used. Maybe with time, Facebook is going to define this as well. Now let's look at the second important thing, the away messages feature. On WhatsApp, when you're choosing away messages as an option so you see you have profile statistics then you have away messages which are the messaging tools so we'll first understand what does away message mean this particular feature is a message that you can activate when you are not active on whatsapp so what you could do is when you are active on internet and you do not want to reply to messages because you're very busy you can activate this and you can have a customized message there so you can see you this message is up here so anybody who sends me a message gets a message from me. Now the best part of this is it doesn't work on groups because groups have these messages all the time. So it's not good to send these supplies to people again and again. So it doesn't work on groups. That's the best part. So it's a very smart move WhatsApp. And you can disable and enable this whenever you want. So for example, you're entering into your office, you're very busy. You can enable this. And when you're 
leaving your office you can disable this at the same point of time you're entering a meeting you can make use of this particular feature it's one of the fabulous features because many times people say me that you don't reply to messages at least this ensures that there is someone who's responding to them i'm waiting for whatsapp to create those customized brackets where i can even write their names so i believe that with time that feature would be all added as well so the next important messaging tool is greeting message now this message feature allows you to send messages to those people who have sent you message for the first time for example you have been putting across a number in the courses you have been putting across your number all across on the internet and people are sending you whatsapp messages to receive updates from you sometimes it is very fascinating initially i allowed people to send me whatsapp messages but it became very monotonous for me to keep replying to them and it becoming very tiring so you have to be on whatsapp all the time and the questions keep coming from people so it's almost frequently asked questions so i completely remove my numbers across on the automation processes so that people can't send me message but this feature is now allowing me to reactivate that entire process again why because when people are going to send me message on whatsapp i can now send them a greeting message so you can see here this is the message which i have drafted so this person who has sent me message for the first time is receiving a message from me because i have activated both the away message and the greeting message together the person first is receiving a greeting message and also a away message out there and this is a great feature guys why because sometimes you have something common to say especially when you run advertisements and you can always get this drafted save it right here so anybody who is going to message you when they see your advertisement is going to see the second part of the message or the information that they are seeking for which will just roll out to them so marketers don't have to personally save their number send their message copy paste all that is gone so that is the fabulous initiative that whatsapp for business has brought into picture now let's look at the third important thing which is quick replies for example now there are a lot of things which people keeps asking and sometimes they are very common i know people ask me about my course about my facebook course about my services about my seo services they keep asking me sometimes how are you they ask me which part of the city are you in so sometimes i have answers defined for this and a detailed answer i can't keep typing this i can't keep searching for those answers and i can't go hunt for those replies which i have done in the past copy them paste it it's tiring whatsapp has made this which says you can define a keyword let's say i define feedback and i draft a message course and then i draft a message fp and i draft a message so anybody who is going to ask me about the course what am i going to do i'm just going to type down the message put the slash icon as soon as i put the slash icon whatsapp will give me options for quick replies so it will ask me which keyword would you want to pick feedback or course or fp so i have to just click on one so whatever message i have drafted for that particular keyword will appear to the person who has sent me message so next time when you are inquiring with me on whatsapp what am i going to do i'm just going to pick one of these and i'm going to send a reply to you so that's the best part so what you have to do as a marketer you have to draft frequently asked questions have a keyword associated or a number associated if you are adding number remember you have to remember that number so it's better that you have a keyword associated you can have a very smart thank you message drafted go a little creative go a little detailed make this look absolutely stunning for a person who is sending message to you so these are some of the important feature something that i have not discussed today is about the statistics statistics is very simple it just talks about how many people you send message to how many people have read the messages how many people have replied to back so that's the figure it tries to give you so now the question is what is the number one benefit for whatsapp for business i have a lot of my clients who have been doing a lot of traditional advertisements at the same point of time they have been doing digital advertisements for example a brand called k fashions which is a very popular apparel store in the city might have holdings across the city talking to people about the wedding collection so how about putting across one simple line which just says whatsapp us on this number to receive the wedding collection on your mobile phone. or the real estate brands that we work for has been running a lot of advertisements out there and in the newspapers so when they have to ask their customers to talk to them instead of saying call us on this number they can say whatsapp us on this number for more details what happens in this process when someone whatsapps you you can first send them a greeting message which is little detailed information about the property or about the product or about the services 
and then you can have reply messages as a sequence message to find which you can send them every single day currently there's no automation but i believe i assume that automation is becoming going to become part of this journey benefit two chatbot automations for example you can see on my blog i have a chatbot and this chatbot is a fabulous chatbot this is a collect chats chatbot and i've used this feature earlier so what happened when i allowed people to send me a whatsapp message when they had a chat with me i almost had 800 to 1000 people sending me a whatsapp message every week and it was a nightmare to save them every single time into a broadcast list so i disabled that but i've enabled it today so somebody is chatting with me here you can see right now somebody is chatting with me will get an option to either subscribe to my youtube channel or send me a whatsapp message when they click this especially on their mobile phone they will immediately get my number and they can send me a message right there trust me this automation really works for which you have to use collect chat and collect chat is one of the fabulous tools you can find the link of collect chat in the description of this particular video so chatbot automations can make your journey much more smoother in order to collect numbers or collect database of people who are interested to get messages from you please ensure that you use chatbots like collect chat which allows you to send you whatsapp messages so when people are chatting with you on the collect chat i'm going to enable this particular tool for all my clients today so that they can have an interaction with the chatbot and immediately send us a whatsapp message for more details the third important benefit is the moment Facebook will make everyone access WhatsApp us feature in the format of call to action button. So the moment people start sending you WhatsApp messages, your ads are going to be even more convenient for you because you don't have to download the leads, call them, no more. You don't have to do that anymore. You just have to send them a WhatsApp message the moment they send you a message. You just have to be quick enough. And for being quick enough, you can activate the greeting messages. So that's about it. I, I foresee that with time, WhatsApp is going to bring automation into picture. I foresee with time, WhatsApp is going to ensure that there are WhatsApp for business advertisements. You can really create a longer broadcast list. So there's a lot more innovation which is going to happen here, guys. Do not forget to download WhatsApp for business and do not forget to teach your clients about how to make use of WhatsApp for business. It's always good that the sales team there uses WhatsApp for business and not your team because your team will get tired of responding to all the messages that they get. With this, I'll end up my video. Thank you.